Thank you very much uh, for uh, inviting us to this uh, event. So today um, I'm going to talk about printing fine interconnection for wrapper on electrodes. So let's start with a very general overview. Uh, this process is applied to uh, tile displays. Tile displays are devices are, are built as a combination of single devices, and on on each device, uh, the conductive the active matrix of circuit is positioned, uh, and both both the active matrix of circuit and the LEDs are position on the front side of the substrate that typically is middle class, while the driver is put on the opposite side. The electrical connection is realized, is realized uh, with the edge electrode, also known as wrapper hand. So um, we developed the realization of uh, the edge electrode entirely by screen printing. With this process, we print the conductive, conductive lines on the front or back of the, sub, of the substrate. And after that, the lines are cured or dried. And the, uh, connect, the final connection is achieved by screen printing conductive lines on the edge of the substrate. With screen printing, it's possible to uh, achieve a minimum printed line width of 30 micron with a minimum, minimum line spacing of 30, 50 micron. Um, for this process, it's preferred to have a chamfer substrate with chamfer size between 30 and, and 50 micron. In terms of electrical performances, um, about a silver ball conductivity of 30% can be achieved. Speaking about mass production, screen printing was proven to be more competitive than standard, standard manufacturing technologies in terms of pattern thickness, repeatability, flexibility, throughput, and cost. Okay, let's now um, talk about the, and let's see more in details the process itself. So the high value problem here is the is finding the proper base that can that can meet all the process requirements. These requirements are um, related with spreading, so we want to achieve fine lines, uh, good electrical properties, so conductivity higher than 20% of silver bulk, good adhesion and low printed thickness with a printed thickness between 3 and 5 micron. In these slides I'm showing um, conductive lines printed very close to the edge of the substrate. Um, the, I, I can show here two pictures and also the profilometer scan of the uh, printed features. We see that with, uh, in the first case, so with non-optimized paste, uh, the pads and the lines are very rough um, with mesh marks and with peaks very close to the substrate, to the edge of the substrate. Uh, with the optimized paste, we can achieve very low printed thickness with low roughness, and at the same time, the spreading is kept under control. I will spend now a couple of words talking about our um, production tool for printed electronics application. So in this picture, you can see an example of production tool uh, that here is, includes uh, an automatic loader, the printer module, in the center and the automatic unloader. It is a, it would be possible also to add um, an inline drying oven or curing oven. With this tool, it's possible to have to achieve a, print, um, a printing area of uh, up to 230 by 230 millimeter. Uh, it's possible to achieve to achieve plus minus six micron repeatability with very high throughput. Uh, at Applied, we deliver the customer's high-value problem into custom solutions, also thanks to our ecosystem that includes suppliers, partners, and other engagements. And at the end, uh, um, this solution can be a very basic proof of, proof of concept. It can be assembling or a pilot production up to, up to the final um, real product, mass production tool. Thank you for your attention.